What's up you guys? Welcome back. I hope you guys are having a good one. For today's video, I wanted to run through a bunch of the kits that Sephora has on their site currently and let you know which ones are worth it uh, to pick up. So the ones that I'm mentioning are must-haves and the value is amazing. And then the ones that I'm not mentioning, I've seen on Sephora's site, but I'm not going to talk about because I don't think personally this year especially i am a little bit more i will say mindful when it comes to purchasing items i've done a decent amount of declutters lately and i'm just trying to really not just hoard makeup i guess or just collect an insane amount and have like a factory in my home if you know what i'm saying um you know there's a time and place for everything and maybe a few years ago i was more into that kind of thing where i wanted like a whole room of makeup but especially now since i actually don't have tons of space i i really need to work with what i have and i'm learning that less is more in a sense so holiday season is an amazing amazing time to really get a good bang for your buck um, just certain makeup items maybe you were interested in lip products lip balms because there really are some solid ones that do come out during this time so i would say jump on those but a lot of the kids are either uh, you know other kids i feel like are a waste of money um, the value is not the bestest and I don't know, it's just there just to be there I feel. So I'm going to run through specifically 10 kits that stole my heart that I want to pick up. And this is 10 out of probably like 100 and I'm sure there's yet to come. So to only choose 10 out of so many, I feel like I'm pretty proud of myself. I don't know if I'll buy all of them, but they're definitely on my radar. I will leave all these items linked down below in the description box if you guys do want to pick up any of these kits for yourself. I do make a small commission if you do purchase through my links, and if you do, I always, always, always appreciate it. I see it, and it really means a lot. First kit that I wanted to speak to you guys about is this one right here from Laneige excellent value now these are smaller sized lip masks now each lip mask has three grams of product as opposed to the full sizes which typically have 20 grams obviously the full size are much bigger but i'll tell you guys i feel like with the full sizes sometimes it's just it seems like a bit much almost and i personally ha would rather have five smaller sizes that still have a decent amount inside than just get one full size even though i have a few other full sizes which i love but um, i still think that this is just like you get a little bit of everything and still a decent amount in each now this kit is actually 20 bucks so each lip product is about four ish dollars you get some amazing amazing scents in here we get the berry which is their most popular scent i feel like that might be their first one that they actually released the gummy bear one which is a yum it's so good oh my gosh you literally want to lick your lips the whole day sweet candy which i haven't tried but i know it's one of their newer ones mango and then the mint one next we have this sephora favorites kit here so they did release a handful of sephora favorites kits i feel like some just seem better than others that they have out now but i feel like this one the holiday lip kit is probably probably the best value it's retailing for 45 bucks and you come with this really beautiful bag you get a full size of the patrick tot lip gloss in pink which is just that his glosses are the best a shawl toby lip liner this is a full size as well and this one is in the shade pink nude i think that that might be one of her most popular colors so solid one the rare beauty glossy lip balm is also included in here a full size of that one one of the huda beauty lip liners are included in here as well in a deluxe size the pat mcgrath lipstick in divine rose is also included in here a small deluxe size of that one then we have the glossier this is specifically called the high shine lip gloss in red it's a beautiful red it's a full size and then the tarte maracuja mini juicy lip plump which i love those are so good in blossom which is a pale pink a mini size so you really Really do get a decent amount of items in here i just want to see when i calculate all of this 45 divided by 7 would be it comes out to about six dollars and 43 cents each now i feel like even with the smaller size items that are included in here there's still solid solid products plus you get the bag and i mean i just know that personally these specific shades are right up my alley there's really a little bit of everything from different finishes to different products so you really get like a nice selection of everything this is definitely on my radar and i personally think it's definitely worth it to pick up okay this i'm thrilled about this is by kosas this is the wet set in the undress duo so you get one deluxe size item in here which is the gloss but the full size item is what i'm more excited about the instant shine like lip butter i have that like in a rosy shade and it's so nice 
from the shade that I have. It's just the quality is so good. So I'm so excited to add this to my collection. Also, their glosses, the wet glosses are just beautiful. This is a duo that you guys know. I love these kind of tones. I know I'm going to get tons of use out of this one. And it's retailing for $24. The value is $34. Bucks. If you break it down, it basically comes out to $12 each. I just think it's a great kit. So I'm personally so excited about this one. I just, I'm obsessed. I need to get all those like lip butters because they're just like so heavenly on the lips. And if you've never tried them, wow. Another amazing Kosas kit that just launched. And I feel like I'm probably going to speak about a decent amount of lip, lip kits because there's just a bunch that's been releasing. But this by Kosas <laughs> looks amazing. I've never tried any of these lipsticks personally. It's their most wanted nude lipstick set. So I want to say they're all deluxe sizes. But with lipsticks, I'm, I'm okay with that. I'm actually even happier with that because... I, I think I've gone through maybe three lipsticks in my lifetime. So this is great for $25. You get three gorgeous colors. I heard that these are fantastic. And I, I love other Kosas lip products. So I mean, I'm sure I'm going to be obsessed with these. All beautiful colors. And I feel like these are pigmented, but not overly. Uh, but I feel like they will have decent staying power compared to like their lip butters, which, you know, don't last the longest, but they're super comfortable on. But I also love the fact that this is the same package as their full sizes. I love when brands don't go the cheap route and just create like random little lipsticks. It literally looks like the full size lipstick just in baby form. So I will take it. I think it's amazing and I think for the price. Next we have this hand sanitizer kit from Touchland. This is $45 and there are five different hand sanitizers included in here. They're all full sizes which is I think I've gone through at least two or three of these. I still have one in rotation, but I just I love the concept of these hand sanitizers because it's a spray form. You just kind of like spray it and like, you know, mush it between your fingers and within seconds, it's like your hands feel so clean, especially now with a baby, I, you know, with pacifiers and like bottles and touching toys and then and putting it in his mouth and all of that. It's like, I want to make sure my hands are always clean. Uh, so obviously if there's a sink, I'll wash, but um, sometimes I'm outside and like, you know what I'm saying? So now more than ever, this is actually very, very handy. I know that each one usually retails for, let's see here, 10 bucks. So you're really not getting too much of a bang over here. You're really only saving five bucks. So what is that really? Um, not a lot of biggest savings, but I mean, I might even get this during the Sephora VIB sale and still save like 20% off during that time. So I could save a little bit more, but just overall, I think this is a great kit. I really just enjoy them. I, I prefer them so much more than the one that you squeeze and put in your hands. It's just like, this just seems like so much more of like a simpler, easier, quicker process. So Rare Beauty actually has two really awesome kits. They have this one, the Mini Blush and Glow 4-piece set for $34, which might be on my radar, but I really know deep down in my heart, I really don't, don't need it. But it's an option if you guys want, so I'm not going to speak about it. I mean, not that I need more lip kits in my life either, actually. So what am I really <laughs> saying? But I recently did like a blush declutter, so that's I'm like, no, I haven't done a lipstick declutter yet. So whatever, we'll see. But uh, this kit here, I think, is excellent. You get two full-size lip products. It's the Everyday Rose Lip Oil and Lip Liner Duo. Her lip liners are so beautiful. I own one. I'm not sure which shade. I like that it's retractable. Uh, it lasts... A pretty decent amount of time and it really just doesn't make my lipstick bleed like it just stays really like well intact and then the lip oil is one I, I don't think I've tried I don't think I've I purchased any of her lip oils like ever so it would be a good opportunity for me to you know test them out I just think they're like two full sizes for 25 bucks yeah, full-size lip duo how crazy is that you're really saving a lot with this next this right here from NARS totally caught my attention it's the invite only yes please mini afterglow liquid blush set so you get three little ones in here small sizes but it's 45 dollars um, so yeah this probably isn't the bestest value ever but i know that if you purchase these individually like the full sizes they're like 30 something bucks each I know that I'm probably never gonna go through these. So three small ones and three different shades does work out for me because I could test out the formula and I could see what it's about. So there's amazing, amazing reviews on this kit, like 70 reviews and it's pretty much at a five star. You get the shades Orgasm. Not obsessed with Orgasm, but maybe the liquid form it might be nicer on my skin. We get Orgasm Rush, which is a rosy bronze and then Dolce Vita, which is a dusty rose. I haven't tried the formula of these. I know that they're fairly new to the NARS game, but I just didn't want to spend 30 something bucks on a single blush that 
I don't know if I'm going to use a lot of, you know, like again, I'm very selective these days. Like I'm not going to just grab anything anymore. So when I saw this, I thought it was perfect. The next kit here is from Sol de Janeiro and this is just like it's an excellent one i think they actually have a bunch of kits on their site currently if this one maybe doesn't interest you but this is the uh, travel perfume set so each one has one fluid ounce of product which i don't think is too bad i think with one fluid ounce you could get a really good feel of what the product like uh, smells like on your skin you can mix and match with these and you know once you're done you can always purchase the full size but trust me i feel like with one ounce it seems like a little bit, but it really is. Like you could do a lot with one. Um, anyways, the, the scents you get in here are the Chirosa 62, 40, 68, and then the Rio Radiance. So if you were curious about these or wanted to try these out or just wanted to have them around, I think that this is a good one. Next, okay, this is so funny. I'll have to tell you why, that, guys, why. So Caudalie just launched this moisturizing hand cream trio. This looks so good. I don't know what it is about hand creams. I just love hand creams in general. There are three different scents. This looks absolutely delicious. The value of this is $27, but it's gonna retail for, or it's retailing for only 16. It's about $5 each hand cream. And I mean, they're not full sizes obviously, but you still get a nice amount in each, one fluid ounce in each. So <laughs> there's that. Um, I don't know what it is about this one, but it really just attracted me. And I'm like, for sure gonna pick this up like any second now. The other day I filmed a declutter video and <laughs> I got this comment that it was so funny. This person was like, your hands need some major TLC. And I'm thinking like, I totally agree with you. My hands are drier than dry. I'm an avid nail biter, I'll be honest. I go up and down and up and down and up and down with it. Now we're currently growing the nails. Who knows what will be tomorrow? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, they look disgusting, I'm fully aware. What all we could do in this life is really try, you know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna try to take care of them. Try to put hand cream, actually, you know, moisturize them and give them some TLC. You know what I'm saying? Thanks, girl. Okay, and the final kit I wanted to speak to you guys about is from Glow Recipe. They have a few kits out now. Um, some that include a bunch of their skincare products or most of their like line But they also have this one which I want to pick up. It's the smooth skin dreams kit uh, So it includes the BHA and HA serum the strawberry smooth one and the BHA pore smooth drops in a small size So these are more on the teenier side I will say but it says for normal dry combination and oily skin again is it really I feel like brands just write that it's for everyone but is it really for everyone who knows we'll see I have dry skin so I feel like it might work out for me I've tried their watermelon drops and their like um, avocado eye under eye cream just a few other goods and for the most part I really do like their stuff I haven't purchased something from them in I want to say a year at least if not more which is crazy to me because it's like what so this definitely like intrigued me interested me i have so much skincare goods that i have to go through so buying another full-size skincare product just to buy if i don't need it and if i'm not running low on something i just don't want to buy that at the moment you know what i mean so i felt like this is perfect it's a good way to test out to see if my skin you know agrees with it if my skin likes it and if it does then i can always purchase the full size so all right, kids are coming home now from school. All the neighbors are outside. Buses are starting to beep. Yeah, again, I'll have all of these kids linked down below. I should have a Sephora haul with selective, select goods <laughs> that I'm gonna be purchasing um, sometime soon in the next bit. It'll probably be like an accumulative Sephora haul too, like I'm not gonna purchase all at once. But yeah, I'm really gonna purchase items that I know I'll for sure end up using and hopefully I'll love, you know? Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this and I will see you all in my next one.